How's it going guys and welcome to another video. A uh, little bit different of an intro to this video because I'm currently in the middle of editing and I decided I would make a two part video out of this one. The part you're going to see in this video is a complete teardown of a transfer case also known as a power transfer unit in a holding Captiva. I'm going to show you what item failed and uh, all the damage that incurred internally because of that in this video now but I'm also uh, in the process of making a step-by-step -step guide on how to remove that transfer case should you have that issue in your vehicle as well so um, you will have both parts the uh, second part will come later in the week and I will link it in the description afterwards without further ado let's get into this video so I have the transfer case now up on the bench and I'm just going to strip it down and show you what has actually happened and you can hear it resonating right from out of there the casing is cracked so I'm going to pop this off right now and have a look inside and see how badly damaged this is Got my impact gun. I'm just going to zip these off. As there's a couple of them on tight, I'm just going to use a bigger impact. Now that we have that off, we have to separate the joint here. So I just need to get something to pry that up and pop it up out of position. Just bring you just bring you over this side where the oil came out. This should be not anywhere like this color and don't know if you can see the metal shavings that's all in there, them little sparkly bits, like a metallic color and paint. That is um that is the result of a transfer case oil that is probably never ever been changed. So I'm going to keep going and get this lifted up now and show you the inside of it. And if you see there, the bearing has completely collapsed. damaged in here as well completely failed damaged all along in here 
and that's the outer part that has cracked. You can see all the internal damage that has happened first. This shell part here, the bearing sits into, completely broken away and collapsed on that side, split. If you look down in there, you can see all the collapsed bearing. It has all meshed up inside. So there you have it, the complete disassembly of the transfer case and we get to see the extent of the damage now. The bearings became worn, uh, detached, broken away and you can see how they've all ended up going through the teeth here and along here and the damage that it's actually done. So we'll ground right along the teeth.
And that is the extent of the failure. There is no repair for the likes of this unit. It was a complete failure, which means a second-hand unit or a new unit was the only way to fix it. And that is it guys, that is a complete breakdown of the transfer case. Stripped it all down so you could see the extent of the damage. I hope you enjoyed seeing exactly what happened and why this failed just like I did. Uh, I do enjoy uh, finding out why a component failed and cracked a case like this one did. You also have all of the information in this video should you want to reinstall a component like this in your Captiva. I hope you enjoyed this video guys, I hope you found it useful. If you did, please like, share, comment and subscribe and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching.